como un bus soldado. What a pussy. What a baby. I thought I'd found a real man, but he's just like a little girl. No one was ever there for me when I was crying my heart out. No one ever comforted me. Random drawing challenge with special friends Mikey Solis, Fruits Friends, and Abnormal Chaos. Let's use the drawing generator. Let's see what we're drawing. Let's get it. Sonic the Hedgehog! Oh god, what's Sonic gonna do? As a fairy! Oh god. Oh no. <laughs>
bedazzling this ketchup bottle and I realized that the words ketchup are just small for me to bedazzle. So I think I came up with a solution. I'm gonna use these things called microbeads. Can you see they're like teeny, 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 tiny. I should have been a surgeon. I actually don't know how surgeons do it. Rete a Jordi Escoto a imitar uno de mis títulos bonitos. ¡Vamos! ¡Ven, hey, Jordi! ¿Qué quieres tú que yo haga? Tienes que recrear este título. Plumón. O sea, idéntico. Hazlo como quieras. Ay, pero si el chiste era recrear. Sí, pues idéntico. Y esto que me saldría muy bien. Primer trazo. Te encargo estos primeros que cuestan más de tu vida. ¡Ay! 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 ¿Quieres ser cool para cuando regreses a la escuela? Quédate en este video. Te voy a enseñar cómo ser un morro los plumones. Morro los plumones cool y divertido. Uh. Primero necesitas cualquier tipo de plumón. Existen muchos plumones. De punta plana, punta pincel, punta normal, chiquitos, grandotes, gordos, caros, baratos, bonitos y feos. Aunque tengas uno, es suficiente. Ok, ahora que sigue. Tienes que aprender a hacer lettering de esto. El lettering es el arte de hacer letras bonitas, así como estas. Así que te voy a enseñar en 10 segundos a hacer esto. Apréndete esta regla. Para abajo es grueso y para arriba delgado, ¿ok? Tú lo escribes siguiendo esa regla. Para arriba delgado, para abajo grueso. Para arriba delgado, para abajo grueso. No. Ya sabes hacer lettering, pero te falta aprender a decorar. Sígueme para la clase 2 de cómo ser morro los plumones. So I recently had an idea. Take a random shape and turn it into something else. Yeah, I know, super original. Anyway, let's go with a basic shape, like a triangle. A lot of great things in life are triangles. You got Doritos, pizza, the pyramids, Illuminati. I mean, I actually have no idea what I'm going to draw. Speaking of triangle, do you know the Bermuda Triangle? It's a mythical section of the Atlantic Ocean bounded by Miami, Bermuda, and Puerto Rico, where dozens of ships and airplanes have disappeared. Ooh, pie slices can be triangles. I think this might be one of my weirdest drawings yet. But no matter, we must continue with the ink. No, don't give up on me, ink. Phew. And thus, Triangle Man was born. Maybe I can help you a bit. Yeah, it's like so bad, you know? Like, well, I mean, if you increase the values in your shadows and your highlights, that might help. But it's like so bad. <sighs> well, uh, maybe you could add more highlights. There's some white gel pens over there. <sighs> I guess, but like, it's still so bad. Well, I mean, uh, this, stop. Let me see. See, it's so bad. Huh, you're right. Excuse me? No, no, you were right. That sucks. You suck. And you should probably never draw again. Shh. Well, whatever. That was kind of mean. Thus, they were fishing. Oh. Random stuff or modern art. Is that a part of it? <laughs> oh. 
It's beautiful. We had a slow start. Starry Night was next door so nobody cared. Time for the big guns. I put it on while they were looking at it. I don't really get it. I don't get it. Yeah. Either. Is that postmodern? Is that is that what you call that? Oh, okay. You want a picture with it? Oh, we're doing an ad picture. No, you can't do that anymore. They made us stop, so we looked at real art. That guy wrote that in Microsoft Words. That's pretty cool.